Hey everyone, welcome back to Pulse Q. Today I'm going to show you how I make pancakes for breakfast. I'll put in the description the ingredients that I use and how much. You guys can follow along or if you have your own recipe, go ahead with that. Let's get into this and see what we got. All right, here's what we're going to do. I've already got one cup of flour here. I'm put a second cup. I like putting all my dry ingredients first. Quarter cup granulated sugar. Quarter teaspoon baking soda. And then you need four teaspoons of baking powder. I will leave a copy of my recipe in the description below so you guys can check it out. Make it yourself, or you might have your own pancake recipe that you want to use. That works too. And then, after that, we need a quarter teaspoon of salt. And that's all for the dry ingredients. Flour, sugar, baking soda, baking powder, salt. I'm gonna get these sifted in, because I use a sifter for it. I'm gonna get these sifted in, and we'll pick back up. So there you go, everything is incorporated in and mixed. Right now, I just gave it a quick mix. I use the mixer. If you guys don't have one, you can do this by hand. This might be a little bit noisy, but I gotta turn it on. Now I gotta add some wet ingredients. I'm gonna need one and three quarter cups of milk. You won't be using it all right away. You'll add some more later. You might not even have to use every single bit of it. And we're gonna add a quarter cup of butter, melted. One egg, and a little bit of vanilla flavoring. I think it calls one teaspoon. I think my recipe calls for. I think uh, I'll leave a description. I just eyeball the vanilla though. That's good. Just like this. I'm gonna get this all mixed up. We'll pick back up. And there we have it. All the ingredients are mixed together now. Everything's nice. Let's turn this off. And that's the consistency that you want. And that's only one and three quarter cups of milk. Like I said, you might not need to use it all. You might need to. I had to use it all today. Some days I've had not to use it all. I'm gonna mix this a little bit more and get the Blackstone fired up and ready. So we'll pick back up and we're outside on the Blackstone. I'll show you how to cook these. All right, Blackstone's up to time. I had it heated up, nice. I turned it down to low now, as you can see. Let's get some pancakes. Make them whatever size you want. I just do it whatever size I feel is gonna be good for the kids. That's how I do it. You can make them any size you want. Here. <coughs> Excuse 
Excuse me. There you have it. Now we're just going to let these go. We'll pick back up and we're going to flip them. All right, we've been about 30 seconds since the last time you see me pour them on the pack, on the blackstone. Let's flip them. go for probably another 15 seconds or so and we'll pick back up when I take them off all right so we've been about 30 seconds now since the last time it's time to take these off we're done There you have it. Pancakes. None on the Blackstone. Nice. Fluffy. Break one open for you guys. There we go. Nice and light and fluffy. Cooked perfectly. Well, you guys know what to do. If you like this one, hit the subscribe. I'll have more for you coming soon. Bye.